Hello and welcome to day 44. It is a bit of a peculiar day, I would say, because in, in a strange way I did all there was to do for all of the things that I planned, all of the things that I promised to myself, including uh, writing and reading and meditating and living healthy in the gym and the cardio and all the stuff. And at the same time, it's been a real weird wrestling in my mind to do those things. And right now, at the end of the day, it's quarter past 11, and I can see that those things made my day way, way better. They actually did add quite a lot of flavor to it, and I think it was a good day. I managed to finish and edit the, the story that I like that I'll be sending for read C prompts. I've been continuing writing on my, working on my own stuff as well. The session in the gym was good, my meditation was, well, average, which means bad. <laughs> and the whole day have passed. And actually it is quite difficult for me to explain why I find it all so peculiar. It was just a normal day, I just did all my stuff. But I think the weird part is that there was a big part of me that has been resisting this day and I have a feeling that this part of me is awake, alive and functioning every single day. Part that simply wants to decompose and fall into entropy. And entropy, that's that's how it is in English, I'm sorry. If I would be a character in the Michael Murcock novel, I would probably say that it's a battle between chaos and the low. And maybe he is right. Maybe he is initially right. That the human being is trapped between those two forces. Being carried in two different directions at the same time. As if two strong winds are putting a great impact on our fragile bodies. With us having... Really not much to say about it all. But this day have passed and it seems like the low one, at least today. And tomorrow, for tomorrow I'm having some hopes and I'm having some fears and I'm having some no's and I'm having some yeses as well. And it's just so weird because tomorrow is going to be exactly the way it is supposed to be and I'll do my best to just do my stuff as I always do and... That's that. What is all this wrestling about? I don't even know. But maybe that's the fate of a human being. And if that's the case, we hardly have any other choice than just to be strong, I guess.